say that there are struggles that happen that really become a tipping point. A tipping point when world opinion and the political weight of the mass movement can have enormous impact even over governments that in every way have been lined up with the U.S. agenda and lined up for decades. And this is certainly true with what we can see in Turkey today where the Turkish military is engaged in, in military exercises with Israel and you have a mass movement that has pushed this in an entirely other direction. Now, also just an opening to say that while world opinion has been galvanized over the massacre that took place in an Israeli raid on, on ships bringing humanitarian supplies who were in international water, that during the last four days, Israel has carried out a whole number of bombings in Gaza, in Gaza, resulting in at least 16 deaths. Has anyone here heard about that? No. You see, it's, it's both the importance of the international de delegates, but it's also the absolutely corrupt way that the, both the U.S. And, and the entire Western media frames this question, where Palestinian lives count not at all. Sixteen dead Palestinians in Gaza lost in bombing raids are completely off the news here. And yet, as soon as this uh, attack on this flotilla happened, and these are heroic, there's absolutely no doubt that it should have had world attention, but we always want to look at that contrast. And this is why people were willing, literally, to risk their lives to draw attention, because it is a silence that's gone on too long, of an absolute concentration camp, which is what Gaza is, an open-air concentration camp. Just the, the other point is that there are times, and this is what's most important, if a movement is organized and mobilized, when the real power of the mass movement can make itself felt and can force through changes. So a real part of tonight's agenda is to talk about the upcoming convoys and how to build and strengthen the mass support right here in the U.S., which is a country responsible for this whole criminal policy and responsible responsible for decades, responsible from the very beginning. We should never forget 15 million dollars a day every day for more than 60 years to the State of Israel, along with all of the diplomatic and political support. 